Finding Latitude with Polaris. My name is Charlie Haffey, and I am an elementary science teacher for the Norwood Public Schools. The Earth is divided into halves. For today's lesson, we're going to talk about the northern half and the southern half. Those two halves are separated by an imaginary line called the equator. If you look at this map here, you can see now the line coming across. That is this imaginary line. Everything above is the northern half, and everything below is the southern half. That imaginary line is called the equator. The Earth is a sphere. Think of a ball. Half a sphere is called a hemisphere. Here we have a representation of the globe in a spherical format. And here comes that imaginary line that separates the top half from the southern half, and that is called the equator. If we look from the equator to the north, we can see the northern hemisphere. And from the equator down or to the south, we can see we have the southern hemisphere. Latitude. Latitude is the distance from the equator, either north or south, to one of the poles. That distance from the equator to a pole is divided into 90 sections. One section is one degree. You'll notice on this map that distances north can be labeled as plus degrees, and distances south of the equator can be listed as negative or minus degrees. Either way is okay. Polaris is the North Star. It's above the North Pole, and it is very, very far away. If you went to the North Pole and you looked straight up, you'd be looking up into the sky and you'd be looking towards Polaris. If you measured the angle between this imaginary line and the horizon, you would see that that angle would be 90 degrees. 90 degrees is also the latitude measurement of the North Pole. We say the North Pole is 90 degrees north of the equator. If you traveled to the equator, and you were looking at Polaris, you would see that Polaris is really right on the same line as your horizon. And we would say that that would be a zero degree angle. The lines are running exactly the same. Interestingly enough, the latitude of the equator is zero degrees. If you went halfway between the equator and the North Pole, and you looked up towards Polaris, and then you measured the angle between that line and your horizon, you would find that that would be a 45 degree angle. And if you're halfway to the North Pole from the equator, your latitude is 45 degrees. Now these lines are parallel. They never get closer together and they never get farther apart because Polaris is very, very far away. When you're measuring angles, you want to use any kind of a protractor. But the best protractor is the clinometer that you can get from the website. Find the angle up to Polaris. So look over the top of your clinometer at Polaris and trap the string against it. And the angle that you measure is the same as your latitude. This was known by ancient astronomers and ancient sailors throughout the world. Finding Latitude with Polaris, my name is Charlie Haffey. I am an elementary science teacher from the Nord Public Schools.